I don't mind doing the hard questions, the hard points that if you've never been in a truck, yeah. it, it's hard to fully relate. My father, it took him from 75 to uh, 85 for him to be able to go from uh, just being a driver to uh, being able to have his own truck that was not lease purchase. And, uh, you know, throughout that, he put in a lot of work, but they were fair to him. He was able to pay off each truck and uh, leave with it. So because this is all I've ever done, because my father drove a truck for his entire career, and um, I'm gonna treat the drivers very fair. But, um, you know, with a lease purchase, with a lease purchase, it, there's a lot of responsibility. Uh, what I would say to the, you know, the people that um, immediately believe all lease purchases are bad, uh, I think a lot of it depends on expectations. Um, if a driver uh, thinks because it's his own truck uh, that he's gonna be able to work less than a company driver, um, that usually doesn't work out because you've got the overhead factor. Uh, and again, this is, a, a, a driver should do whatever makes him happy. If if you're more if you're more comfortable at 2,000 miles a week, then you know, pick the best company job you can find, and uh, and do that. But if you're if you're long haul in a lease purchase with drivers that are in that 2,500 to 3,000 miles a week, uh, those are the drivers that are happy with a lease purchase, glad that they made the change, and. Uh, are making more money than they were as a company driver. The biggest thing I do is I make it, uh, I make the pay predictable and straightforward. The freight market is not as good as it was two years ago. But because we are in this for the long haul, we make sure that our drivers are unaffected and Specifically how we do this is we make sure that they are getting paid as much as if the freight rates were higher. Now, does that mean we are less profitable? Absolutely, we're absolutely less profitable than we were two years ago, but uh, that's not the driver's fault. And so uh, we, we take much less profit, sometimes no profit, to ensure that our drivers are unaffected by the downturn in the freight market.